as you enter come right into the center of the travel trailer your three burner stove microwave and hood is directly in front of you and your sink is to the right and your control panel is also here which controls this controls your elevator for your back end two queen size mattresses the bottom one also doubles as a couch on the elevator so I'm pushing the button right now we'll lift these to the very top of the trailer once raised to the top The back end can slide down or fold down. The couches will also fold flat and up against the windows. And that leaves you uh, basically from the stove all the way to the back end there for parking whatever vehicles you can fit in there. And if you count the floor tiles, you're looking at 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, about 11 feet plus from the stove to the back and you're looking at about one two three four five six seven seven and a half feet to eight feet wide in the back end of this to park four four wheelers easily five if you come up to the nose a little bit all the way up to the sink you could probably fit one in this area um, a rail buggy would be very easy a couple golf carts whatever your uh, poison is it'll fit in here then to your right have a refrigerator that's larger than your standard refrigerator door here that closes off the master area sink bathroom pool tub And closet on the left and queen size bed in the back um, it's hard to tell in the video got a stereo system surround sound inside and outside uh, monitor up here you can hook up to a cable box or computer I have a DVD player in there right now central duct air condition uh, system this is the intake for it, and it is ducked. And you can see places in the ceiling throughout the travel trailer where it's ducked in. Um, high and low speed on your air condition. Uh, your furnace is down here. The refrigerator is auto changeover, LP or gas. And on your control panel here, you can see you have your battery indicator. I got a full charge. Your fresh water tank, I got three quarters of a tank. Black water is three quarters and you can take it and empty it. Gray water is one, is that basically at E. So that's my system monitor. Uh, my generator start right here. I can push this down and start generator by push button. That's my primer. Push that and that starts generator, which I'm not gonna do right now. Uh, fuel pump timer, this has got an auxiliary fuel pump system that is for filling your four-wheelers or motorcycles you push this fuel pump timer and it gives you 15 minutes of fuel pump outside at the auxiliary pump station which shares with the generator fuel tank I believe it's a 50 gallon tank 30 is reserved for uh, the generator it won't allow you to uh, pump all your fuel out the fuel pump station uh, and leave your generator empty your water pump, LP heater, gas heater, uh, floodlights outside, inside, uh, side floods, rear floods, that's your ceiling lights there, and my porch light. So, all of that 
Um, many more, many upgrades to the outside, like I said, 